Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be doing a review on the new Yeti 200X lithium generator. The reason why I chose this generator rather than something a lot bigger is simply for mobility. For It's for something I can take out into the woods or uh, something that we can easily just move around the house if there's a power outage. So let's get to it. All right, so let's get into this. All right, let's see, here. Let's see what we got. Got the guide. Accessory cables. More accessory cables. All right, so here we go. So, so I guess what we got here is we have the uh, the power source to plug into the AC. So that's gonna go into there. Got the covers. So what we got here is we have two USBs. It looks like we have one 160 watt uh, in and out, one AC, and a and a port for the car. And this will be our display. So let's get it charged and let's see how it works. So it took about four hours to charge the battery from beginning to end. So it's got uh, three different buttons here. You press. First one for USB. You can also press another one for AC and one for the 12 volt. It's got a great handle here. Weighs about five pounds. And it's got the wall plug right on the back there with a great little fan. So when it's charging, you could see the, the charge symbol there. Uh, obviously it's fully charged, but they actually also recommended that you keep it plugged in when it's not in use. Uh, that way it's ready to go. If you can't plug it in constantly, then they recommend that you give it a full charge once every three months. So this has been my review of the Yeti 200X lithium generator. I'm definitely going to be buying some accessories for it, which will include the 12 volt water lily. And yeah, I uh, hope you guys have found this informative and I definitely recommend it. See you guys in the next video.